boys and girls, it's Miss Carol. And this is our fifth week of Sunday School Google Classroom. I hope you've been listening to the stories I've been telling because I certainly love reading to you. This week I'm going to read two stories to you. Not related to our lesson this week, it was just two stories that I just wanted to read to you. So the first one is called The Children. Mothers held their babies as they walked. Boys and girls skipped and hopped down the road. They were happy. They were going to see Jesus. Here they all are. Can you see them? Oh yeah, there they are. They're all ready to go to see Jesus. But when they got to the place where Jesus was, Jesus' friends told them to go away. You cannot come to see Jesus, they said. He is too busy for children. He has important things to do. Now Jesus found out what his friends were saying, and he was angry. Do not stop the children, he said. Let them come to me. Well, oh, here's Jesus. He's, he's not happy. See, he's telling them. Don't t and here's them telling the children to go away. Here's Jesus telling them, no, no, I want the children to come to me. So they came, little boys and little girls, and even babies. They came to Jesus, and Jesus took them in his arms. He was not too busy. He held them. He blessed them. He loved them because children are important to Jesus. Jesus loves all the little children. You remember our song that we sing in Sunday school? I'm gonna sing it to you now. If you remember this song, sing along with me. Ready? Jesus loves me, this I know. For the Bible tells me so, little ones to him belong. They are weak, but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. The Bible tells me so. Very good. I hope you were singing with me. Okay, are you ready for story number two? I think you're going to remember who this person is. This is one of my favorite stories. And I know we sing a song that goes along with this song, this uh, story in Sunday school. So if you're ready, put your thinking caps on and see if you can remember the song that goes along with this story. Are you ready? Here we go. It's called A Small Man. Zacchaeus was a man who took tax money from people. Tax money was what they had to pay to their king. But Zacchaeus, he took more money than he was supposed to. He kept it to make himself rich. And nobody liked him. Oh, there he is. Can you see him? Oh, there's Zacchaeus. Oh, he's got all that money. <gasps> okay. One day, Jesus was passing by his town. Everyone went to see Jesus. Even Zacchaeus went to see Jesus. But Zacchaeus had a problem. He was short. Everyone was in his way. He could not see. Then Zacchaeus had an idea. Do you remember what his idea was? He ran ahead of all the people and he climbed a tall tree. He had found the perfect place to watch Jesus. He could see all the people coming. When Jesus got to the tree, he stopped and he looked up at Zacchaeus. And you remember what he said? Yep, Zacchaeus. He said, come down right away. I need to stay at your house today. Oh, Zacchaeus scrambled down that tree. Jesus wanted to stay with him. He took Jesus to his house and he told Jesus, I want to do what is right. I will give back the money I took to make me rich. 
Jesus was pleased. Zacchaeus had chosen the right thing to do. Okay. Do you remember the song that we sing in Sunday school that goes along with this story? Will you sing it along with me? Okay, are you ready? Here we go. Zacchaeus was a wee little man. A wee little man was he. He climbed up in a sycamore tree for the Lord he wanted to see. And as the Savior passed that way, he looked up in the tree. And what did he say? He said, Zacchaeus, you come down, for I'm going to your house today, for I'm going to your house today. Oh, boys and girls, I hope you sang that song with me. I hope you're having a wonderful week. And I hope you're enjoying the stories that I'm telling and reading to you. I so enjoy doing it. And I hope you have a wonderful week. And until the next story, blessings to you. Bye.